Okay, I tell you what, I don't know if it's the coffee or what, but man, I, I am feeling something, so I'm pretending it's coffee, and we'll just lay off of that for today. All right, I, I was thinking about what to do today, and I th just had the thought, well, let's take, let's just practice this, you know, using different kinds of form. I'm going to make a hot dog character today, uh, based off of a character that was designed by my wife, I thought was pretty neat, a little uh, super hot dog there, and uh, let's just go through this, we'll go from flat to dimensional, or not flat. She had his bun like wings. Give him his mask. All right, and when, you know, when we're thinking about this, this is a really good, uh, character to use actually because the shapes are very simple. I remember getting hung up really bad on noses and on mouths and uh, ears. All right, and those are complex forms. So we're going to uh, go simple. And we are going to go with a hot dog today. Everybody knows what a hot dog looks like. Even if you're a vegetarian, you can get vegetarian vegan hot dogs, so no one has an excuse. Other than snobbishness, maybe. All right, there's our flat hot dog guy. Okay, we basically have this, oh, what, what do you call that shape? We got this roundish, longish hot dog shape. This shape over here, we got these boot shapes here. So, and he's wearing his bun like a, like wings. I don't know if I want to stick to that or not, but we'll we'll see. We'll see what we can do with him. All right. And let's let's dimensionalize this character. I'm going to move over here closer to the hot spot on the camera. All right. And when I'm drawing this, when I was drawing it over here, you know, I wasn't thinking just it's it's weird. It's it's crossing a threshold. It's making a breakthrough. Uh, when you when you know when you can when you can gather the necessary information to hold these shapes and forms uh, in your head in a three dimensional way, that's what we're going for. All right, getting our hot dog the right shape. All right. Dimensionalizing. Step one. Bam, bam. Check that out. I, I. One's bigger than the other. They're in perspective, okay? I've got my mental vanishing point, sort of, but, you know, you just make one bigger than the other and feel it out, you know? It's just a, uh, just a cartoon, so it doesn't have to be anywhere close to being perfect. So don't work, work yourself up. You know, keep those nice, loose, flowy lines. And then the eye, you know, just think of these things as dimensionally as you can. You know, they, they are rounded, dimensional forms, okay? Get his mask on. And the shape of the mask is a great opportunity to redefine the shape of this hot dog. 
and then the mouth dimensional you are drawing it in space how I might do it though let's see what what can we do here Use that to define a little fold of the cheek. Give him a bottom lip there. We'll